Corey's uh, truck manufacturing plant is opening here in Jefferson County. It'll bring with it more than 700 jobs to the area. Now that plant is called Auto Car and it'll open in Center Point. CBS 42 News reporter Conan Gasqui is there. And Conan, they're using an existing facility for this new plant. Yeah, they're going to be here in the former Meadowcraft facility here in Center Point. If you're not familiar with this facility, it's got about 1 million square feet across the span of two different buildings, and that's part of what made it so attractive to the folks at Auto Car. They already produce three different kinds of industrial vehicles, and they say with all this extra space they're going to have, they can actually start to produce even more different kinds of industrial vehicles. So it's a good opportunity for them and for the state of Alabama. To some, this sound is just what you hear from a garbage truck. For many in Alabama, though, it signifies the creation of new jobs. Great news, not only for this area, but also for the people of Alabama. These trucks were on display in downtown Birmingham today. Autocar will manufacture them in Center Point, providing more than 700 jobs at an average salary of more than $58,000. It will also have an impact that will be felt for a long time in Center Point and surrounding areas. Production has already begun and about 100 jobs have been filled. So far, both local and company leaders like what they see. The impact of new jobs is already evident. As I walk through the plant, I recognize people from Center Point that are working there already. On my very first day at our plant, start time is 6 a.m. I pulled up at 525. There was a line of cars, 15 or 20 long, waiting to get into the gate early to start their first day at work. My friends, that doesn't happen in very many places. The company will continue expanding, and research from the University of Alabama shows it'll have an annual economic impact of $645 million. And for people wondering about getting one of these jobs, they can find out more information about those openings at AIDT.edu. That's AIDT.edu. We're also going to have more information about that on our website, WIAT.com. Live in Centerpoint, Count and Gasqui, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.